Coming up next, Muhammad's strange killing of dogs revealed. Hello everyone and welcome back to Somali Christian TV. We are your favorite Somali ex-Muslims spreading Christianity and exposing the deception of Islam. If you want to learn more, smash the subscribe button now. I'm your favorite host, Somali Prophet, back again with another interesting video, this time exploring Muhammad's strange, murderous fixation on killing dogs. Yes, you heard that right, killing dogs. Let's begin with the Hadith. Hadith Ibn Majah 1 1 369. It was narrated from Abu Huraira that the Messenger of Allah said, Cats do not invalidate the prayer because they are one of the things that are useful in the house. Okay, so cats don't invalidate the prayer. What about the other household pets? Hadith Ibn Majah The Prophet said, The prayer is severed, disrupted by a black dog. Hadith An Nasai 542 4281. My mother told me that Jibril, peace be upon him, said to the Messenger of Allah, We angels do not enter a house in which there is a dog or a picture. The next day, the Messenger of Allah commanded that all dogs be killed, even small dogs. The angels will not enter your house if you even have a picture of a dog. The hatred of dogs runs deep, doesn't it? So, in this hadith, Muhammad commanded the death of all dogs. What about in the next one? Hadith An Nasai 542 4284. It was narrated from Ibn Umar that the Messenger of Allah commanded that all dogs be killed, except dogs used for hunting or herding livestock. Oh, that's convenient. You need your dog for your work? That's fine then. I guess he'll just change his mind on this weird topic. Hadith Sayyid Muslim 10 3811. Abdullah reported Allah's Messenger ordered the killing of dogs and we would send men in Medina and its corners and we did not spare any dog that we did not kill. So they killed every single dog that they saw. So what is the punishment for even owning a dog in Islam? Hadith Sahil Bukhari 767-391 Narrated Abdullah bin Umar, Allah's Messenger said, If someone keeps a dog neither for guarding livestock nor for hunting, his good deeds will decrease in reward by two qirats a day. You'll lose two good deeds a day just by owning a dog. Not only must you go out and kill them, but if you own one, you'll, you'll even end up in hell. How is it that you won't end up in hell for waging war on non-Muslims and killing Jews? But this is where Allah draws a line? What an arbitrary religion. So come to Jesus instead, who teaches love and compassion. So for now, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you smash the subscribe button now and hit the bell so you never miss any of our videos. Support us on PayPal and Patreon. Somali Prophet, out.